Hey there guys, it's a friendly neighborhood gaijin. So, I just got through the school about like an hour and a half ago. And um, went to the second hand shop to look for some green pants. And after the second hand shop, which didn't turn out to be profitable, um, I didn't find any. I decided to walk around Sekura Day, which is kind of like a little town just next to Nanima. And then I kind of went into the back and got myself a little bit lost and walked from Sakuradai to Nerima, back to Nerima, Nerima. And I just want to point out that even though it's kind of like not happening, you know, it's not like there's not very much activity, people just kind of A to point A to point B, there are tons of little shops that are used or secondhand, and there's tons of like little fish markets, like the one I'm looking at, that one right there, and little trinkets. Japanese love the trinkets. So if you have a day after, if you have a free any free time after an appointment or school or anything like that, and you kind of want to kill some time, kind of want to explore just even like a unknown town you just go and go in the back of it and just start walking around and you know you might not buy anything or but you kind of get like this little hometown hometown type feel even though this buildings are like ooh. If I haven't mentioned it already, the crow's yard, gigantic. You could feed a family here. The families here are huge. So, getting yourself lost in these little towns lets you experience this kind of little personal feel for where you are. You get to really kind of mesh in your soul with the town you're walking around in and I say that because the streets are like not even 10 feet wide the buildings are straight up and it's this really small kind of like a garden feeling when you're walking through a garden and there's it's an orchard when you're walking through an orchard Except for, it's an orchard of buildings. It's a building orchard. It's a concrete orchard. But each tree has its own personality. Each building has its own personality. And, you know, you got little trinket shops. You got little ramen shops. You got little coffee shops. You got little, be a storage container. And then they took everything out. And now there's a, fruit stand or a vegetable stand, mostly vegetables, vegetable stand there, and you know, there's like a little tea pottery shop, there's a little liquor shop, there's a little drinking shop, a little everything, anything you can think of. If you want to, if you have like, you know, Nissan in your pocket, 2,000, 2,000 yen roughly like twenty dollars in your pocket and then you want to you know you, you want to stay in your pocket and you want to go spend it and you already bought your train ticket home then going getting lost in a little town and find something that you want to collect is the perfect way to do it and I highly suggest that <laughs>